Buongiorno e benvenuti, I'm Stephanie Smith from Lionel Luxury Real Estate and I'm here today to show you this fabulous luxury villa for sale near Porto Cervo. Check it out! Look at what a mesmerizing view we have from the property. I'm so excited to show you this villa today. We are in Sardegna, right above Porto Cervo, which is the most elite location of La Costa Smeralda, that also has some of the most beautiful beaches in the world. La proprietà ha posizione dominante e si trova in un'elite zona residenziale dove puoi godere di viste mozzafiato ma anche di tranquillità e privacy. Inoltre si trova solo a due minuti dalla bellissima spiaggia di Liscia di Vacca. We are on the front side of the property that has three main accesses, two of which for vehicles and each has its own parking area, one covered and one non. So the property can easily fit four cars. Before we go inside, let me tell you a little bit more about the villa. The property is 975 square meters, has a total of 10 bedrooms and 9 bathrooms, has a dépendance, a home cinema, and a fitness area, and is surrounded by 2,320 square meters, featuring a private garden, two panoramic terraces, a swimming pool, parking area, and external kitchen with barbecue. For those of you who are new to our channel or haven't done it yet, don't forget to subscribe and leave us a comment. Ma ora venite con me. We are in the foyer of the main entrance. The floors are made in travertino, which have a very particular design. It reminds me of bubbles underwater. The walls are covered in wood, and I love the handles that are shaped like a fish. This is a very important symbol and you'll understand why in a second. To my right is the guest bathroom that serves the floor, but now let's go check out the kitchen. Here we have a charming breakfast area that overlooks the professional kitchen. The central island is surrounded by a beautiful pattern on the floor that is made with the same granite used for the countertops. Every appliance in the kitchen is double and is of the best quality, like Gagnau and Miele. The kitchen is made for preparing large quantities of food to host large dinner parties. It also has a wine chiller. Other than that, from here we have a double access one onto the outside and one towards the swimming pool area. The property was built by the famous architect Luca Scacchetti, who envisioned it as an oval surrounding the internal swimming pool that is shaped as a fish. We will find many details and elements throughout the villa that recall the sea and sea life. However, he maintained the architectural style, which is typical to the island, integrating it in the uncontaminated nature instead of disrupting it. Surrounding the swimming pool is this lovely sunbathing area and also a lounge area. So you can really enjoy this space all day long. But not just that, in this area where there is an outdoors kitchen with barbecue. Let's go check it out. This space is a perfect example of what I was mentioning before. The property was built to integrate with nature, not disrupt it. Here we have a perfectly equipped kitchen.
with dishwasher, induction stove, and oven. So everything you could really need. And it looks onto an external dining area with this long granite table that can host a large number of people and is illuminated by a personalized chandelier that calls back to the sea. Right in front of it is this wall with soft and delicate movements that frame the external oven and barbecue. As soon as we enter, we immediately see the dining area, which stands out for the deep red color of the floor and of the walls. At a first glance, it looks like the wall is covered in paintings, but in reality they are windows that look onto the garden and embellish the space. This space, even though minimal, has all the essential features of being truly functional and is perfectly connected to the kitchen. The dining room is connected to this open space, triple living area. The first thing that leaves us in awe is the fact that on both sides of the room, the walls are covered in windows. So we can enjoy the breathtaking view over the sea and the Archipelago della Maddalena, also from the swimming pool area. As you can see, the sea is the true protagonist of this house. This space has light wooden floors. And here is a charming breakfast area with access to an external lounge area. While central to the room, we have this gorgeous sitting area, which is perfect when you're hosting guests. Right in front of me is the TV area, which is ideal for those moments of relax and in which you just wanna kick back and watch a nice movie. Also from here, we have an access onto the panoramic terrace. We are now in the bedroom area. I love how you can see the swimming pool from each common area on this floor. Also, you have multiple accesses towards the space through these large French windows. From this area, we have access to three bedrooms on the floor. This room has its own private bathroom with rain shower and the ceilings are retro-illuminated with LED lighting. Other than that, it has a gorgeous view over the surrounding nature and you can access, through the large French window, a balcony. And I love the bed's headboard. It has such a unique design. What do you guys think? We are now in the middle room, which has its own walk-in closet and bathroom with bathtub. I like the darker color used for the wooden floors. It gives more warmth to the room. This is the third bedroom that has its own walk-in closet and bathroom with rain shower. Through these large French windows, we have access onto a balcony and a beautiful view over the uncontaminated nature. But now I want to show you the master bedroom, so follow me. The entrance to the master bedroom is illuminated by LED lighting on the floor that highlights the wooden detail on the ceiling. The master suite has its own walk-in closet with a window that reminds us of the porthole of a ship. Opposite is the master bathroom. The bathroom's floors and walls are covered in dull tile marble. Here we have a jacuzzi tub with wooden detail on the ceiling and a rain shower with chromotherapy that you have to check out for yourself because it has a floor to ceiling window with a view over the garden so you can take a shower with the view. The first thing we see when we enter the master bedroom is this large French window from which we can access the balcony with a breathtaking view over La Cipelago della Maddalena. I must say, Sardinia has some of the most unique landscapes worldwide. The master bedroom has its own private sound system and all the details are built in, like the nightstand and the desk. 
but we're not finished here. We still have so much more to see, so follow me. We are now going to see the lower floor where we can find the entertainment area. I love the technique used for the staircase. It feels as if it has always been here. The atten look at the attention to detail of the lead lighting on the banister that continues down on the floor to illuminate the staircase. The villa has its own fitness room with bathroom and access onto the garden. I like the colored lights above the equipment, but the most interesting feature of this room is the window right in front of me that looks into the water. So it feels like we're underwater and gives the room this really relaxing color. The fitness area is connected to this home cinema with surround sound and a big screen so you can really enjoy movie night. I want to point your attention to the walls with the exposed rocks. The villa is developed following the slope of the hill and it has its own access to the outside. Above me is a skylight that looks onto the living room and brings a lot of natural light into this space. But now, I want to show you the dépendance. From this building, you can really understand how the property is truly integrated into the uncontaminated nature. The Dependance has a living area, bathroom, and bedroom. The bedroom has a beautiful corner window where you can really see and appreciate the uncontaminated nature. I mean, just look at the color of those flowers. They're gorgeous. The bed has a beautiful customized headboard and its own private bathroom with walk-in closet. While the living area, even though cozy, is extremely functional. You have everything. There's a TV area, a dining area, and a kitchenette that, when needed, can be closed off. Isn't that genius? But the true gem of the Dépendance is the panoramic terrace. Come and see what a view. Let's just stop for a second to really appreciate the beauty of this view. Other than the dependence, there's also this independent bedroom area with common patio with lounge chairs where you can just sit and take a moment to yourself. It also has maximum privacy because it's surrounded by nature. This space has three bedrooms, three bathrooms and three walk-in closets. It can either be used as single bedrooms if you have many guests giving them their own independence because each room has its own private access or it could be used as a large apartment thanks to the connecting doors inside.
That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed yourself as much as I did. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And on that note, I'm going to go and have an aperitivo at Fee Beach. Ciao!